do it! Yo, 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 yo. I said, yo. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Giants, coming to you guys with another video, man. If y'all new to the channel, you already know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Make sure you guys check out the links down below in the description, man. Got my secondary channel, my vlog channel, and my Twitter, at Rings. Both links are down below in the description. But we're going to get straight into today's video. So, as you guys can see by the title, yes, this is a two-way slash and playmaker build with a 25 three-pointer. Now, I know you guys can't see the stats, but if you guys want to see an animation update on this build, simply get this video to five likes, bro. Get this video to five likes, and I will come through with that video for you guys. But it's interesting how it's been working out with this build. I've been using this build a ton in the rec center playing with randoms and i've been winning a ton of games and there's a couple of methods i want to show you guys uh you know after this video and you know in the next couple of videos i do but all in all i just wanted to talk about the use of this build now as you guys see also see by the title i did end up recording a triple double so i'm just showing you guys how the fourth quarter how the fourth quarter went and um you know how my play style is now i am able to fade with this build bro i can literally fade with this build the finishing is great the playmaking is high level the defense is high level. Everything on this build is high level. The only thing I cannot do is shoot threes. So some people may think, oh yeah, this build is trash. Like I play with some randoms that says, oh, this build is trash. You can't shoot threes, blah, 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 blah. But I can literally do everything else. So what build in the game can literally do everything? So it's just funny to me when people say that because there's builds that can't play make. There's builds that cannot defend. You know what I mean? There's builds that cannot dunk. So there's builds that every build has a flaw you know for the most part every build has a flaw even if you try to make the build all around it's still gonna have some sort of flaw so me using this build hasn't you know hasn't been bad at all um when i play make it's it's great because as you guys know um you know if you played park primarily or whatever the case may be a lot of people ended up making builds that the pass accuracy wasn't prioritized so what that ended up doing was when you go to play rec you get a ton of turn a ton of turnovers this is what was happening to my main build you guys know my main build is a two-way scoring machine i haven't made a video on him in a little while um because i haven't been using that build that much but um using him just ended up getting frustrating because all i had was a crazy you know a crazy scoring game and then obviously my defensive stats was there a little bit but i mean i was like what like six five on that build or six four or something like that i think six five but um, I probably had minimum wingspan. Um, I could get steals, but um, no interior at all. You know, the, the build wasn't that bad. It's just the pass accuracy was that. Oh, I couldn't dunk on that build also. So that build is great for park. Um, and it does play into the build that I usually do make. But it's just that it's a little bit different now because I can't dunk with that build. All my main builds usually are able to dunk. But the way how 2K22 next gen, uh, you know, made you your player be limited in a sense to where you can't really overdo it my build was literally not even able to dunk so now that i'm on this build i could dunk play make do everything so basically when i'm playing in a red game i just play the lanes i mean you guys pretty much know how it is in a wreck if you don't know um the lanes aren't as it's not sweet like it was in the past in the past but everybody typically does the same thing um, outlet passes tend to work for most people. You see, most of the time, people are already running back or leaking out on a fast break, trying to um, get an easy bucket. You see me trying to shoot a fade right there. Bad shot, honestly. But um, those are the shots I can usually make. Now, at this point, I probably had a couple less badges because, you know, not like right now as I speak, all my badges are pretty much maxed out. But, you know, in this video right here, the, the badges were maxed out. But it was damn near maxed out, but not 100% maxed out. So, yeah, you see me using the bullet passer badge. Um, I wanted to speak about that too. The bullet passer badge makes an uh, extreme difference. Uh, I mean, it's obvious, but you know, especially in the wreck, it's very, very important. I also use needle better. Um, I'm not sure if I have it on Hall of Fame or Gold in this video, or you know, I can say maybe it was on Gold. I think I just put needle better on Hall of Fame. But um, yeah, those two badges are super important when you're playing in wreck. Um, obviously they work in prize. I got a nice steal right there, bang time, but. Yeah, they work in park, but for rec, it's obviously extremely important because there's ten or there's nine other bodies other than yourself running around on the court. So the lanes, it'll be a lot easier for you know for something to go wrong for you to get a turnover. Um, a lot easier for somebody to just press square and reach their hand out and get a steal. So you being able to have bullet passer and needle threader, it'll allow you to make those more um, passes that are a little bit difficult or that would have been stolen easily 
um, a lot more difficult to steal. So I've been enjoying this build simply off of that. Um, it, it, it may sound crazy. I mean, when you guys hear me say this, anybody that's watching me for a while, if you look at my videos, I really do enjoy passing the ball. Like, you see me getting a nice dime right there. Um, I always make builds that have the ability to score just in case I have to do it. Um, I'm not sitting there playing to score first. Um, I just take it as as it comes. So when I'm playing with my two-way scoring machine, um, I try to make plays. Obviously, he's a two-way scoring machine, so clearly, you know, he's out there to score, whatever the case may be. But whenever I try to make plays or I'm trying to be a playmaker because I'm a point guard at the end of the day, I can't do it because I have 25 pass accuracy. But with this build, that changed everything. That changes literally everything. And I'm not missing anything using this build versus my two-way scoring machine, which is my first build because I can literally do everything on this build better than my two-way scoring machine can do except shoot threes um, and fade. You know, I can still fade on this build, but it just won't go in as much because I don't have all those, you know, badges that may bail me out if I don't fully, you know, release it the right way, like Hall of Fame Sniper. On this build, I only have Sniper on Silver. But yeah, you guys can see I revealed some of the badges to you guys that I have, um, you know, but... Like I said, guys, if y'all want to see an animation update of this video or of this build right here, please give this video to five likes and I'll do that for you guys 100%. But you guys can see right here, at this point, I got the double-double and I'm just two more steals from getting a triple-double. Now, the center, I can remember from this game, as you can see right there, he shot the shot. He's trying to get a double-double. Yeah, I think he's trying to get a double-double um, and he only needed three more points. But I was just telling him, like, bro, you don't need to shoot a three. You can, like, just, as you can see, the scoreboard right there. But... I'm telling him, you could get two more easy layups instead of trying to forcefully shoot a three. Like, it's just funny. Playing rec, you know, it's been fun because you get to see the IQ of other players. And then it's just fun because I've been able to get, um, you know, I've been able to love, like rep up and stuff like that, build up my level. Because I haven't got level 40 at all. But this season, right, so far I'm on a great track. Like, I'm definitely going to get level 40. Um, season one was, obviously I was on a great track too because, you know, 2K just came out. I was playing it a lot. So I ended up getting um, level 36, and that was the highest I've got. But I want that level 40 now, man. I missed out on a tiger. I missed out on a go kart. I missed out on a skeleton uh, mascot. I missed out on everything. So at this point, I just need to get that. You know, I need to get that. Uh, you know, that level 40 reward. And to be quite honest, um, I think that you need to get four. No, I don't think. I know you need to get four level 40s in four different seasons to get. Um, legend and I know the legend reward is not anything good. It's only a parrot, but it'll be cool to say that I hit legend again But um as you guys saw I got that final still I was super excited when I got it. I got it the last minute clutch as hell, but um Yeah, it's gonna be you know It's gonna be interesting to see if I can actually finish out the last couple seasons because I think there's only four more seasons left We're in season five right now. So six seven eight nine So yeah, there's about four more seasons left because I think there's like nine seasons in total in the entire 2k cycle this year so yeah guys this build is definitely very nice very nice rec. like i told you guys or like you guys seen in the other video i made this build i made it specifically for rec but i can still go to the park and do perfectly fine with it i just need to play with someone that can shoot and then a center that can also shoot so and then i'll be perfectly fine after that i can still fade and do everything i need to do so yeah if you guys want to see more rec videos like this and if you guys want to see an animation update on this video or on this build make sure y'all leave five likes on this video and i'll do that for you guys and yeah it's gonna be easy also guys i will be getting wwe 2k22 and just doing a lot of content on it because it's a new game it's another 2k game so it'll be great to get all that content so make sure you guys do everything i just said like comment subscribe and more it's your boy jam ranks i'll catch you guys in the next one man peace Gang, they cannot do it like him. Uh, uh huh. Nobody shooting like him. Gang, nobody doing like him. That nigga.